Their motto here is, it's hard to find, but not easy to forget. This is Bistro. Give me a rice plate, tahini, and harissa. The Southwest meets the Middle East. Anything that comes out of this kitchen is just an amazing experience. Falafel stuffed pita loaded. Bistro is all about the passion of chef Greg Menke. We have followed Greg around for many, many years. He told you he was in the attic of a mall. You found it. Yes, so cool. And this tucked away quick service Middle Eastern mashup is coming straight out of Chef Greg's travel log. I lived in Greece for three years and traveled all throughout Lebanon, Syria, and Jerusalem. There? I was opening restaurants for the uh, Greek Olympics. How cool is that? Is this the type of fare that people will typically expect when they come to Santa Fe? Absolutely not. They're in for an experience. We got a stuffed pita steak for Kim. I generally kind of gravitate towards the steak shawarma and then put all the different sauces on it. It's just a great combination of flavors. So what are we making first? Steak shawarma. OK. Full milk Greek yogurt, a little red wine vinegar, lemon juice. Black pepper, kosher salt, cumin, coriander, cardamom, cinnamon, and a little bit of garlic. That yogurt helps in breaking down the flank steak. Lifter meat, very okay. much like flank steak. Pretty generous with the marinade there, boss. How long does the marinade go? Three days. What goes with this? Either a stuffed pita, a rice plate, or a salad bowl. It's Middle Eastern street food. Next up? Green chili zoo, the Yemeni's sort of salsa verde. Cilantro, parsley, jalapeno, green bell pepper. OK. Black and serrano, green onion, fresh garlic. Salt. Cumin, coriander, fresh lemon juice, extra virgin olive oil, blitz this. Got a little bit of water. Delicious. Now we're going to make our quinoa tabbouleh. Fresh parsley, chiffonada mint, green onion, quinoa. You want this cool. You don't want it hot, because it'll cook your herbs and it'll taste like a lawnmower. Never gone down and tasted you that. Don't want, you don't want that. I don't think I do. Pepper, extra virgin olive oil, lemon juice, and a little salt to taste. All right, grill the meat. Salt and pepper. We just toasted the pita. Steak shawarma coming off the grill here. Pitas traditionally come with hummus, cucumber salad, lettuce. OK. We got some daikon radish sprouts. That's the bee's knees. Be careful. Be hurrying up. Some steak. You like beets? Love beets. Quinoa tabbouleh. I love to get fully on the tabbouleh. <laughs> Carrot ribbons, onion, turnip pickle. I like all the choices I get here. Tahini in there. The green chili zoog we made. Some za'atar. Za'atar is Middle Eastern time with a little sumac, a little sesame and salt. And Bob's your uncle. Bon appetit. Who's Bob? Your uncle. Did I miss something? Everything is really fresh. I love the acid. I love the crunch. Can't beat it the pita. Look at all the color inside of that. I've taken three bites, and not one of the bites is the same bite that I took the first time. It is way more than a sandwich. It gives me goosebumps. It's delicious. Steak stuffed pita. The steak shawarma is very tasty. I like the chili zubi because it brings out the flavors of everything put together. And it's all wonderful. 